Hi, my name is Gordon from Gimeo, and today I'm going to show you how to install your email signature into your Apple Mail on Mac OS. Before you start, you'll want to make sure you're using Google Chrome to copy your email signature from Gimeo. This is because Safari doesn't copy some HTML tables which are required for your email signature to work correctly. So, once you're using Gimeo in Google Chrome, you want to head over to the installation tab and then click on the click here button to get your signature. This will copy your signature to your clipboard and then it's ready to be pasted into your Apple Mail. Head over to your Apple Mail and then click on the Mail button up the top and then Preferences. Click on the Signatures tab at the top and then select the email account you want to install your email signature for. In this case, it's Exchange and then click this plus button at the bottom. Give your email signature a name and then click on the right hand side text box. Press Command A to select everything and then backspace it out so there's nothing left in the box. Then press Command V to paste your email signature. You'll notice that your email signature images have nothing in them. Don't worry, your email signature images will show up correctly when you're composing an email. This is just a limitation in Apple Mail. You'll want to make sure that this box here is unticked that says always match my default message font. When you tick that box, it changes everything to be plain text format like so. And that's not what you want. So make sure that this box is unticked. Click back into the middle box here, and then you can select uh, which signature you want to use for your outgoing emails. In this case, this is the only one we've got. So we'll just select the test sig. Now there's a couple of other settings that you'll want to make sure are set up correctly before using your email signature. So head over to your composing tab and then make sure your message format is set to rich text. And then also make sure that this box here is unticked, the one that says use the same message format as the original message. Head over to the viewing tab and then make sure that this box here is ticked that says load remote content in messages. Once you've finished installing your email signature, close the settings window and then click to create a new message. You'll notice that your email signature pops up straight away. If you have any issues installing your email signature, feel free to reach out to our support team and we'll help you out. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.